Hey, what's up, JK Shiners? The live stream will be starting real soon. So sit back, relax, grab a drink, maybe a beer, a nice little beverage, and get your questions and comments ready as I will be live in a few minutes. Hey Jaycationers, grab that snack and a drink yet? We're going live real soon. Now, let's get involved in the comment section here on the live chat. Let me know where you're watching from. See you soon. What's happening, everybody? Can y'all hear me loud and clear? Sorry. Uh, let's see if I can get this to zoom right so it looks uh, not blurry. What's up, everyone? Thanks for joining the stream tonight here on Jaycation. Tonight, we're going to talk a little bit about the uh, orange tier, what's going on here in San Diego, and uh, you know what the, what the changes are and um what's open what's not open what capacity um means for indoor dining um our movie theaters back our you know we know sports is back because the padres are playing but uh how many people are allowed into these padre games we'll we'll have to talk about that so thanks for joining me on this uh thursday you know we're doing two uh two streams in a row. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna, I'm trying to focus this because uh, it's not the most uh, clear <laughs> um, clear camera. But what's up, everyone? Let's see. Let's start off here with the. Uh, I'm gonna try my best to get through all these comments. I see we got 31 peeps on here. If you guys can please smash the like button, I really appreciate it. And we're also gonna be doing a few giveaways. So. I got three giveaways. They're nothing like my 25,000 giveaway, but you know, they're, they're a little something. And for those of you that are still waiting for your giveaways, I will, I promise I'm going to the post office, but they're here. They're here. And I have your names written down and stuff and addresses. So they're coming. I've just been smashed and haven't been going to the, uh, smashed with doing all this filming that I haven't been able to go to the post office, but it's coming. I promise. I didn't forget about y'all's. All right. So let's see. George Lopez says, where are we going? Jay, what's up, George? Shout out to uh, you in the south side of San Diego. Um, we're just uh, going to talk San Diego here uh, here at home. I'm watching the Laker game. That's kind of why I scheduled a little bit of a later stream. Let's see. Is everybody saying that I can hear, can hear me? It looks like, uh, oh, okay, everyone can hear me. Um, Jose Orozco says, what's up, Jay? What's going on, Jose? Thanks for tuning in today. Taco Lover says, sup, Jay? It's Taco Lover, what's going on? Shout out to you. And you said you're in Oregon, I think? Francis Sevilla says, it's 10 p.m. in NY, but wanted to check it out. Well, thanks for staying up late 10 p.m. in New York City. Shout out to everybody in NY. My homie, Here Be Bar, what's up? I'm just, I was just talking to him a little bit ago. Um, taco lover sushi time here on the West coast. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. I'm actually going to be involving some sushi in my cheap eats video next week. So stay tuned guys. I'm doing a, 
cheap eats video, five spots around San Diego that are cheap eats. Francis Sevilla says noise, noise. Taco lover still have lots of sun here. Yeah. The sun's still going down. I can see the uh, cotton candy skies out my window a little bit peeking through the blinds. What time is it there? It is 7.06. Uh, Lakers are down by three with five minutes to go. Sorry, I had to just naturally give that update. <laughs> Jennifer Soria. Hello. Hi, Jennifer. Thanks for coming in tonight. 7 p.m. here in Oregon. Yeah, we're in the same uh, time zone. Crystal Lara, thanks for coming in. Hello. How you doing? I, uh, I saw you on the chat yesterday, so thanks for coming in on the live stream again two days in a row. Um, Francis Sevilla says, my question for Jay is how is it so far in terms of COVID over there with orange tier? I know there's going to be more capacity with California recovering. That's so great. You know, everybody's, a lot of people are out and about. I wouldn't say everybody, but it's pretty busy out in the streets. Like I've been filming the last three days and, uh, and yeah, everybody's out and about, um, it's still a little weird seeing people inside restaurants, but it's now a thing and they've upped the capacities over at the restaurants. So uh, let's see what was I'm trying to figure out the uh, numbers here. Uh, restaurants capacity increases to a maximum of 50% or 200 people, which ever is fewer. So outdoor and indoor uh, dining will continue. So that's pretty good. And Museums uh, can increase to 50% capacity and movie theaters, indoor capacity increases to 50% uh, or 200 people, whichever is fewer. So a lot of good things happening around town. Um, family entertainment centers and bowling alleys can be up to 25% capacity. Um, amusement parks like, you know, Disneyland, the zoo, uh, Legoland, um, 20 maximum of 25 percent up from 15 percent under the red tier with in-state visitors only okay cool so yeah there's a lot of good things happening and i think more and more people are starting to go back to the gym i'm actually about to start picking up my gym membership try to lose a little weight <laughs> uh john says uh thank you so much thank you john uh, that was that you that i met yesterday i'm not sure but what's up john yes we can Hear you clear. Nice. Cool. Kissy cat. What's going on? I see the four leaf clover and the cowboy emoji. Thundercats. Who? Oh, <laughs> what's up, Joshua? Thanks for tuning in today. Joshua, you know, you know that those movie that those marionette Thundercats, is that what they're called? Thundercats or oh, the Team America? Those things creep me out, man. I don't do those things. I can't watch those movies because like they creep me out, man. Lakers are up are down seven. Uh, down five now four minutes to go brian says what's up jj lakers down by six yeah i got it here i got it here on the on the tv ashley says thanks for the update yeah for sure and we'll talk a little more about it i got other things here um so they say outdoor live events capacity can increase to 33 percent in state visitors only and primarily in seat concessions yeah so like petco park they uh make you order your food through an app and uh, and everything um, in Pego Park is done through the app. They don't have like vendors walking around selling popcorn and sodas right now. Um, you actually have to order everything digitally. And I think the tickets are all digitally as well. And uh, yeah, I haven't gone to a game yet. I was around the park on opening day, but I haven't actually gone inside yet. Um, my last couple games were over at, um, where was that? Over in Peoria welcome back yeah john thanks orange taint <laughs> uh the tear yeah orange taint <laughs> ashley ignacio says glad you're talking about this yeah you know it's important that people know exactly what's going on here around san diego especially if you're visiting or if you're from here um you know everybody's still got to wear their masks indoors especially if they're going to be around people and um you know there's more and more people getting vaccinated now. So I think it's uh, a lot better to go out and about and, and people are starting to do that and feel a little more comfortable. It was weird at first for me, but like ever since going to Arizona, going to Vegas, I'm pretty much uh, used to it. And the Lakers are down by eight. Sup taco lover. How you doing? 
Oh, dude, I don't know anything about that stuff. Gra gambling Granny, Jay. Hey, hey, what's up, Gambling Granny? You got me thinking about uh, the El Cortez in Vegas. Um, I'm going to be rolling out my Vegas videos. Uh, I got one more video tomorrow, which is Whataburger. And I'm going to compare it to Shake Shack and In-N-Out. So stay tuned for that. I'm actually going to edit that after this live stream tonight. And, uh, and yeah, I'm going to be doing all Vegas videos for the next couple weeks. Uh, mixing in San Diego, of course. There's still going to be San Diego stuff, like my best coffee shops in San Diego. That's coming up soon. And, uh, and yeah, Taco Lover says free puppy. You know, I wish I could give away uh, free puppies. <laughs> All right. I'm, oh, wow. I need to catch up on these. Mark DeLeon, what's up, Mark? Thanks for uh, coming in on a Thursday evening. What's up, my boy, JJ? What's happening? You are the man, Mark. Kenny Ramos, what's up, Jay? What's going on, Kenny? Congrats, man. Kenny, Kenny was the winner of one of the uh, $25 Seaport Village gift cards. And, uh, Kenny, let me know if uh, Seaport Village sent it over to you yet. I'd, I'd like to know if uh, you got it already. And I will be choosing the winner for the second gift card this Saturday. I'm just giving more people time to enter. So if you haven't watched the Seaport Village video yet, you have a chance of winning a $25 gift card if you answer a question at the end of the video. Gil says, can't watch just now. Lakers behind the heat a bit. Be back later, Jay. I understand, man. I'm actually, I got it on here and they're down by almost 10 now. So I understand. I'll be here. Well, you know, Kobe's gone. So what can you do? Kissy Cat. Hey, Granny, what's up? <laughs> nice. Gra Granny and Kissy Cat all, all up in here. Yeah, we shall see, Jay Ray. Taco Lover. Yes. Gambling granny. Yeah. See, that's cool. I like having friends uh, on here and hanging out with people. Adriana Manalang, what's up? Hi, Jay. How you doing? I hope you're having a good night. Sean Pittman, what's happening, Jay? Not much, man. Just hanging out here. I'm rocking my uh, Ale Smith Mostra Coffee t-shirt. Ghost Bear is a Mostra Coffee uh, uh, coffee that is uh, coffee bean that's made in the philippines and uh ghost bear is the name of it and they did a collab with the speedway stout with alesmith which i'm actually going to pop open i love how alesmith collabs with different brewery uh different um coffee spots in san diego to make like this this type of speedway stout so uh i'll pop that open in a little bit cheap food it's cheap sushi barf <laughs> Any more sports venue content coming? Um, Gino, let's see. Sports venue content. Um, I'll probably I'll probably hit up Petco at some point. Um I'd like to go to a Golden Knights game in Vegas, but I don't know how how expensive that's gonna be. So maybe. Um maybe I'll do a tour at Allegiant Stadium because I know that they're opening that up. So maybe I can do something there. So yeah, there, there, there'll always be sports. I mean, you guys can tell that I'm sports is a big thing for me. Erica Nunez, what's up? Hi JJ, watching you during my daily walk. Nice, getting that, uh, getting that steps in, getting the steps in for sure. Um, I was out at PB today filming my uh, coffee shops video, got a few steps in over there, and uh, I met with uh, Rob Rast. So uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys a little bit more about Rob Rast uh, later on. We got some cool things, uh, Jaycation, uh, Miles Board collab, and uh, we're continuing on with that. So I got a couple things I want to show you that I'm really excited about, and a couple of promos that uh, Miles Board is doing with Jaycation viewers. So yeah, stay tuned. Um, Julia Hall says, "Just wanted to thank you because we are having the best time in San Diego after watching your videos." We visited several places you talked about in your video. Nice, Julia. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate that. And it was it's really nice seeing people out and about. I met a couple of nice people from Carlsbad yesterday um, out at the farmer's market and over by uh, Senior Grubbies. And uh, yeah, they all said, you're Jaycation. What's up? And, you know, we took I took a couple pictures with some people uh, today. I didn't and out. Yeah, somebody took a picture with me. So that was cool. It's nice meeting everybody and good to hear that people are having great experiences in San Diego um, after watching some of my videos. Joshua says, where 
I'm from restaurants are packed. Y'all get used to it. Oh yeah, we're used to it now. I believe me, opening day restaurants, uh, it was packed. Believe me, it wasn't even 25, 50% capacity. Oh, Lakers are done. Oh well. Watching the Astros. Yeah, my nice. My Padres are actually off today. So this is a, actually a really good day for me to uh, to live stream. So let's pop open this uh, Speedway Stout here. And what I really liked about the Speedway Stout here, down in the bottom here, it says glassware. Use a goblet. Serve it at 50 to 55 degrees. Pairs well with banana bread. Established 1995 in SDCA. So that's, it's right down there, those little square blocks. So that's really cool. And I got a goblet. I got a Deschutes goblet. So we're going to pour it in here and uh, drink this during the live stream. I can see we have 62 people. I'd really appreciate y'all hitting that like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, plenty of San Diego content to come. Um, let's see. Thunderbirds. <laughs> Taco lover, be careful about reopening. Here in Oregon, we are locking down again from 50% to 25%. Washington is about to do the same. Yeah, people need to be more cautious still. And hopefully we don't go backwards. Francis says, I know the theme parks are just allowing California residents for now, but I fully respect that. But I will be at La Jolla on Memorial Day week. Going to be my boyfriend's first time on the West Coast. Nice. Cool. I hope you uh, you and your boyfriend have a great time. And uh, and yeah, Memorial is always cracking here in San Diego. It's going to be a good time. So uh, I'm going to raise this up. If y'all have a glass, I'm going to raise it up too. Cheers. Oh man, this ghost bear is nice. I don't always drink stouts because they're so strong. This is a 12%. So I'm just going to be sipping on this. This is an Imperial Stout Mostra Coffee and Coconut. So, yeah, it's nice. Larry, Larry Nguyen says, Hey, Jay, when will you do more food videos with Norma Heli? Larry, Saturday will be your day because uh, I have my La Pizza y La Pasta video at Italy in Park MGM in Las Vegas. I'm uh, posting that, and that's with Norma. So expect the next three weekends at least one video with Norma in it, one food video. So uh, the first one is at Italy, and then stay tuned for the rest because it's, uh, they're actually pretty cool food videos, and uh, I, I hope you guys enjoy them. I actually got to finish filming the one for next week. Um, here in San Diego, because I'm doing a comparison of L LV versus San Diego comparison video. Uh, Martin says, hi, Jay, what was your favorite food at Carlsbad by the flower fields? Okay, so windmill food hall is great. I love the windmill food hall. Um, I like district one pho. Um, yeah, their pho, their, their uh, filet, the rare steak filet mignon. That was really good. I enjoyed that. Um, and the street tacos over at El Puerto is really good. Shout out to Catalina, the owner over at uh, El Puerto. So I really like the street tacos there. And the cacio e pepe too is uh, is on point. You just got to eat the cacio e pepe right away when you make when uh, when you order it. Um, if you heat it up, it, it kind of changes its um, consistency a little bit. So, but that's like any other food. So yeah, I definitely say go to Windmill Food Hall. Um, Francis says it's probably going to be a beach week at the most. Yeah, for sure. It's gonna be fun. It's getting hot here in San Diego. I was in PB today and I was sweating my booty off. I'm telling you, it was hot. Kells says, "What up, JJ? What's up, Kells? That's my cousin up in San Francisco, South San Francisco Bay Area. What's up? Shout out to you, Kells, and the and the fam. Say hi to everybody for me." Josh, what's up, Josh? It, it sucks putting on weight. It's like, how did that happen? Eating, eating, pandemic, and not going to the gym. Yeah, that was that. That's why I packed on 20 pounds. I need to slim down. Um, Adriana Manalang says, lots of changes going on. Follow CA Events Coalition on Instagram to keep up with date guidelines. Nice. Yeah. Good tip. Thanks for that. Yeah. CA Events Coalition. Christopher Moreno, you are shredding it, Jay. May your blessings and those of all your listeners continue. Shout out to you, man. Thanks. Oh, wow. I thought I was caught up, but I'm not. Nice. Jay Wood. 
It's uh, this is actually a hat made by Original Goodstock. It's a buddy of mine. Uh, his name is uh, Moss. Shout out to Original Goodstock, and he makes distressed pottery hats. Um, so he's got his logo, Original Goodstock OGs, and then he got Faith on the side. It's a snapback, and uh, he distresses the Padre uh, design. So that's kind of just like a, it's just like a fashion thing. So that's what the hat's all about. <laughs> Yo, yo, what's up? Here be Barr checking in from Brooklyn. That's my boy, uh, John Barr. If you guys haven't subscribed to John, he's almost at 200K subs. And I want to get get my boy to 200K for when we collab in Vegas and we, maybe we could celebrate his 200K milestone. Um, we're going to be doing something in a couple months in Vegas. So I'm excited. And I'm just excited to hang out with John because uh, me and him are really, really close YouTube buddies and we uh, always just talk shop. And uh, his dad is a loyal Jaycationer. Um, Crystal, what's up, Crystal? Um, what's up, Jay? Happy Thursday. Yeah, happy Thursday to you too. How's everything going? Joshua, yo, Jay, that grab-and-go tuna sub screwed me all up, dude. Can't think about nothing else, dude. Tunisia, that, that thing's fire. That thing's fire. I'm telling you. Um, you, got the, you got those capers in there. You got the... Uh, the tuna there is on oh man and uh shout out to christian uh, um he he was uh i think he runs the uh grab and go the one i went to he uh he showed some love on instagram the other day so shout out to him and his uh family that own uh grab and go francis sevilla says any filipino restaurant suggestions for date nights Ooh, in san diego <sighs> man for date nights I mean, Max's is expensive, but that's like very, very formal. Uh, you could go to Via. What is it? Um, Via Manila. It's a Kamayan place. I don't know if Kamayan's resumed, but that's over in National City. Um, I mean, places like Zarlitos and Titas, they're not like date night places, but you know, you can go have Filipino food over in places like that. Um, yeah, I actually had really good Filipino food at Mostra yesterday. Shout out to uh, Mike, Mike uh, Arquinez, Chef Mike. Um, he was cooking yesterday, and uh, I had one of his uh, Langonisa sandwiches. It was really good. You'll see it on the, the Best Coffees in San Diego video. Gran Granny got me to stay in El Cortez. I love it. Kissy Cat, that's what that, like, I'm, I'm really curious about El Cortez now. Like, I really want to stay there now because of, you know, everyone talking and rave reviews about it. Um, Kel says SDCC on Thanksgiving. You going? Well, I do have a media pass. I don't know if my media pass is good for that, but we'll see. Um, I'll definitely be around there live streaming. So yeah, come say hi if you guys are coming to uh, the Comic Con light in Thanksgiving time. Rachel's Adventures. What's up, Rachel? Thanks for joining. Rachel's one of my uh, newer Vegas mods. Um, stay tuned, guys, because. Uh, Last weekend, the last week of April, I'll be going live almost every day in Vegas. Probably every day I'm in Vegas, I'll be going live. So uh, last week of April, stay tuned for that. I'll also be doing content around town. Um, so stay tuned. I, I have a lot of great stuff going on for that. J-Rock Cast, what's up? Sup, J? Adriana says, Better Buzz Coffee. Nice. That's a really good spot. Now, Better Buzz is just a little more of a... Uh, like a chain here so i'll eventually put it on uh in, in other videos this is not my only coffee video but yeah better buzz is good that it'll get you wired cali love how's it going jay I'm, I'm i'm doing good well my lakers aren't doing good they just lost 104 110 i'm turning off this tv <laughs> um Rachel's adventure adventure says smash that like button. Thanks, Rachel. I've I've been seeing you on the uh, turn it up world uh, live streams. Oh man, those live streams are so hard to keep up with. Joshua says, "I'm telling you, what a burger!" <laughs> Wait till you see my my review of it tomorrow. I'm not that harsh on it, but let's just say I have other places that that I prefer. Kissy cat. Oh, kissy cat is, you know, kissy cat is uh, 
knows everyone in the, in the Vegas scene. And I'm I'm really happy. Thank you to all like the new Vegas um, subscribers, the people that came because uh, they were on my Vegas live streams. I'm I'm really excited to uh, show you guys, you know, my forte with Vegas. You know, I've been going there since I was a kid in my 20s. I went there once a month and it's so weird. I've been vlogging for a few years, but I've only done one Vegas video and that wasn't even about anything about the strip. And it was more like a family vlog over at the, uh, I think it's called the sparkles. Was it the sparkles? Something like that. It was a baby shower of my cousin. Um, that was the only video I did in Vegas until just recently. Now I got a buffet video out about Vegas. I got, uh, and then on Saturday we're doing the Italy video, me and Norma's, uh, collab first collab, well, it was the first collab we filmed, second one that I'm showing on the channel. And we got we got like three or four more videos, uh, me and Norma um, doing some food stuff. So stay tuned for that, guys. Perla says, have you had Mr. Beast Burger? I have not, Perla. Actually, I've heard of it, his ghost kitchen. Um, I've heard mixed reviews about it. But, uh, you know, maybe eventually I want to actually try Eats by Sam, which is um, Sam the Cooking Guy's ghost kitchen. So that might be my next... Uh, that might be my next thing. Maybe do a ghost kitchen video. and Maybe I'll do Mr. Beast Burger and I'll do Eats by Sam. I'm trying to connect with, uh, I'm very ambitious. I know Mr. Sam the Cooking Guy is 2 million subscribers, but uh, I I'm trying. I'll let's see if I can get Sam the Cooking Guy on Jaycation. Uh, Joshua Newberger says, don't forget about that Vaughn's Deli vid. Good idea. Thanks, dude. Not for reals. My chicken artichoke sandwich there is one of my favorites. I love their broccoli and cheddar soup. So good. Yeah, Vons is going to get some love eventually. And yeah, stay tuned. Clancy Smith says, thoughts on Fernando Tatis. You know, man, if he's really hurt and he needs surgery, you got to protect him. If it takes a year, it takes a year. If uh, if he can play through it and he it, it doesn't hurt him in the long run, it's really about getting him better. And, and whatever is the best option for getting him better for his shoulder, I would say uh, go for it. Um, if he can play in 10 days or, you know, a month from now, two months from now, and he, and he's totally fine, then yeah, go for it. But I would protect him. You know, I'm, he's, he's here for what was a 14 year deal, something like that. While well, we're up to 80 people, appreciate it. <laughs> Mark De Leon says represent Pinoy businesses, respect. Yeah. And I'm going to be highlighting Mostra, Mostra coffee. Wait, let me, uh, Mostra coffee. Boom, boom. Where are you at? Boom, right there. Um, good evening from AZ, Will Stang. What's up? Shout out to AZ. Everybody treated me so good over in AZ, man. I loved it. I'll be back next spring training. Maybe even earlier. Well, maybe even earlier. Maybe I'll do something in AZ. There's the homie Butler King. What up, Jay? Hope. Yeah, what's up, man? I'm going to cheers to you, Butler. Always so nice to see you on the uh, live, ch live chat. Alberto... Silas says, greeting, Jay. Love your videos, man. Keep up the great work. Thanks, Alberto. Appreciate it. And uh, and yeah, I hope you enjoy what's to come. And actually, I was just thinking for my Vegas friends or my Vegas viewers, start telling Pompsy. Pompsy follows me on Instagram now. Start telling Pompsy, hey, man, hang out with Jaycation. Yeah, I, I kind of want to kick it with uh, Pompsy. I don't, not, not even collab, just to hang out and talk YouTube. It would be cool. Um. Gino says, you should do a video slash collab with our Super 73 group, Sunday Ronin. We meet up at Mostra in 4S. Hey, hey, Gino, was that you? Were you there yesterday at the uh, beer, at the beer day? Because I saw uh, three Super 73s parked in front of me by the fountain behind Mostra. And then uh, I saw a couple of people there uh, at the table next to me. I don't, I don't know if that was you, but... Um, yeah, I saw the Super 73s over there. A lot of people like to park it over that way. So, yeah, if that was you, man, let, let, let me know. Um, Lori says, hey, hi, Jay. Thanks for sharing your beautiful vids. Love them all. I'm glad that you like the vids. And, uh, yeah, I hope you liked uh, this weekend's videos. Seaport Village video is doing well. It's up to, like, 11,000 views. So thanks to everybody for watching that. Um, giveaways are definitely a, a fun thing, aren't they? And speaking of giveaways, let me do the first giveaway. And I promise I'm going to mail this out within the, I promise I'm going to mail this out within the first week. Oh yeah, I need to refocus. Wow. What's so, what's wrong with the focusing on this? Uh... 
Let me fix this. There we go. That's better. Um, so my first giveaway. So unfortunately, the um, Flying Leather Next Museum closed down. But before it closed down, I got this uh, limited edition print of a motorcycle and a jet. And I will write you a nice little personalized message in here. Send it off to you. And I will also add this Mike Hess sticker. So uh, I'll do a giveaway about that. Oh, man, now I have to think of a question. Shoot. <laughs> I wasn't prepared for this, guys. Um, all right, let's think of a question real quick. Uh, create a banner. Um, okay, now I know. Okay, hold on. All right, I got I got the question. So now I have to uh oh. Or I didn't. All right, hold on. Okay, there we go. Add banner. Okay, now I got it. So here it is. Here's the first question. Um, I'm going to have to s get onto my live stream on my phone. And I will say the first person wins. Um, I'm going to uh -oh. have to. So the first person wins. So if you guys are ready, let me see at least one ready on here. And uh, I'm going to take out Lori's comment real quick. And then I'm going to put up the question. And... First person to answer this correctly. So if you guys can say uh, ready. Okay, we got Christopher G saying ready. Okay, we'll we'll do this now. So first winner, find me on Instagram. I'll get your address. We'll send this over to you. This is the question. What is the name of the brand of the distressed SD hat I'm currently wearing? So I'm looking. I see a lot of readies, readies. Let's see what happens. Let's see what the first comment is. Cali Love. Cali Love got it. OG. Yep. Original good stock. Shout out to Cali Love. Um, send me your uh, address on Instagram. Direct message me and I'll get this over to you. I promise. And I'm going to get all the other cards <laughs> over to people. <laughs> So thanks. Thanks, Callie Love. You are the winner. You are the winner. So shout out to you. All right. So I got two more. I got two more uh, giveaways here. So stay tuned. Um, I need to find where I was. Lori was the last one. Okay. Butler says, the day is well. Yo, you ever peep those rooftop cinemas in downtown? Butler, I did a video there of uh, the opening night. I was at media night of uh, SD Rooftop Cinema at the Manchester Grand Hyatt. So I'm actually going to uh, I'm actually going to do that video in my next Hidden Gems video, but I just don't know when I'm going to release that. <laughs> um, but I did. I even inter interviewed the owner, um, Jerry Cottle. So, yes, yeah, for sure. I I'm going to show that. Uh, it was... Uh, Let's see, the video was Ferris Bueller's Day Off. And whoa, Gino, what's up, Gino? Thanks for the super chat. Much love to you. Thanks, Gino. Cheers and positive vibes to all the Jaycationers. Cheers and positive vibes to you. Thank you, Gino, for the uh, for the uh, nice super chat. I really appreciate that. And thanks to everybody. You know, I throw these super chats back into uh, Jaycation, and they really help with the uh, food reviews. And wow, I didn't even see this super sticker from my boy here, B-Bar. Dude. Wow. Thanks, man. Thanks, John Barr. Appreciate it, man. And I'm excited for uh, June and hanging out in uh, Vegas with you, you and your uh, significant other and Ben. So if you guys haven't watched uh, Here Be Bar, go check him out if you guys like Vegas stuff. Um, yeah, 
and and John's John's awesome. He's he's one of my closest friends. So, um, where are we at? Man, I've lost. Uh, okay, that yeah, was Butler Kings. Brian says, says, yo yo yo, what up, Jay? What up, Brian? <laughs> Joshua's ticked off because he missed Carlsbad last night. Went to that military school out there. <laughs> well, at least you got to watch the replay, right? Um, Lori says, I'm going to visit some of them in SD. Thanks. Nice. Cool, Lori. Mark DeLeon says, I always get too shy to say hi to YouTubers I see. Yeah, people don't be shy to say hi to me. <laughs> don't be shy. Believe me, I'm, I'm more than happy to say hi, especially if even if I'm live streaming. I know sometimes people don't want to be on camera, so I try to like put the camera away. And then if they say they want to say hi, then I'll that's when I'll do it. So shout out. Uh, Genified says hi. Hi, Genified. Ooh, we got another super chat here. Um, Vince, dude, Vince, thanks, man. Vince with the five dollar fill up. Big up to Maddie. Yeah, Maddie's uh, outside, man. They're eating duck again for dinner. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll be eating duck again um, later on tonight after this stream is over. But you know, I'll be on here for a while. I might not be eating until later. Um, let's see. Joshua says, uh oh, it's beer 16. Beer 16. And I am blurry again. I need to do a better job with lighting in my room. Can we get uh video influencers to come in here and make my uh, room all video influencer nice? Like, what's up, Benji and Joel? Uh, Benji, uh, I said Benji and Joel. That's uh, Breaking Benjamin, isn't it? <laughs> Benji Travis and uh, Sean C uh, Cannell. Come in come in and make fix my studio up. Dave R says cheers. Nancy says cheers. Can't believe you were one of those dudes stuck overseas last year. That was a hard vid. I was stuck overseas last year. I'm so happy that I'm back. I'm actually uh, going to talk about my, my first flight coming up in a few months. It's still a few months away. Um, Nancy De La Roca says, have I done any, uh, brewery videos? I've actually covered them like here and there in like my Miramar video. Uh, I did a five craft beers to try when in San Diego, but I just stayed at one place and just talked about the breweries. Um, yeah, nice Tupac shirt. I see there. Brian says, says, Jay, you should do a video here in Palm Springs before it gets too hot. We have two breweries that are both good. Oh, I'd love to try those breweries. I love it. I'm all about it. Yeah, for sure. One of these days, uh, you know, I want to connect with Palm Springs. I have some friends there. Shout out to the uh, uh, Alex and Arnie over in Palm Springs. David says, we we still need to do that zoo video. Got a pass for you. And you already know, think blue, Dr. Gang. Hey, David, man, what's up, dude? Um, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Um, Probably like May, uh, if you're cool, like May, May or June. I'd be down to do a zoo video. Yeah, man. Show me around. Kells says, yee. Adriana says, Kells, hello from San Jose. The Zay. You y'all be gigging. Isn't that what it used to be? Gigging? <laughs> um, Larry's asking if I'm a gamer. I am 100 percent not a gamer. Even though I love video games when I was a kid, I have all the consoles still in my in my garage. I got the Nintendo, the Super Nintendo, the Genesis, the Dreamcast, the uh I even have like the Intellivision. I got PS1, PS2, PS3, PS4. I still don't got the PS5, but I was, I had, I like playing baseball games, uh, ba basketball, sporting games. That that was my thing. Um, since Celine Dion's Vegas show is closed, she's been home with that new young husband of hers. Loudest. <laughs> I'm not reading the rest of that. It's Angela. Hi, Jay. What's up, Angela? How you doing? Nancy De La Roca says, tried out Kiko's seafood place yesterday. It was really good. Spicy octopus tacos. Yeah, their octopus I heard is really good. Let's see. Can you imagine crossing Pompsy? You'd end up like one of those dudes who nab wins kid. They ain't gonna make it. <laughs> you know, dude, I I I like Pompsy. You know, we're uh we're Instagram buddies now, you know. Hopefully, uh we can connect one of these times I'm in Vegas. Um, Pompsy's chill, man. He, like, like we got. I was on his live stream. I'm sure you saw that. I was on his live stream 
for some reason I didn't record her. I can be like, dude, we should uh, take a picture. But uh, I think Popsy's cool, man. And Greta too. Shout out to Greta. What he does is crazy, man. He he. It's I I understand the uh, challenges that he goes through. David says, still need to get Jay surfing. It's San Diego. You got to do it for the channel. I'll leave it to the, the experts, man. I'll leave it to the experts. I, I, I'm I the beach bum at the bar drinking a beer. <laughs> MT says, what's up, Jay? Ordered your Cali burrito shirt. Can't wait to rock it. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it, man. Much love. Um, yeah, I got my Cali burrito shirt here. I need to get more more Jaycation and Cali burrito gear. And I actually have a, a design coming up made by Gina from the Something Sweet Shop in Seaport Village. She's a very talented artist. Like all her murals are awesome around her store. And um, she's creating me a shirt. And you might be able to find it at the Something Sweet Shop when it does come out. And I'll probably end up putting a design out on uh, Teespring. So stay tuned. It's a San Diego themed shirt that I think everyone's going to like. Uh, my SD Burrito shirt's pretty cool. So I I, I see everybody uh, purchasing it. So thanks for for the love. So thanks for, uh, yeah, thanks, MT, man. One of my moderators, MT, shout out. Um, Christopher G says, sup, Jay? I'll be in San Diego later this month. What's your must-try dessert place? Well, you got places like Handel's, uh, Papaleco, uh, Extraordinary Desserts, Oh, excuse me. Beer burps. Ooh. <laughs> um, yeah. So, yeah, those places are great. Um, I like boba. So, I like to go to boba spots. So, go to uh, Share Tea. Share Tea is a good spot. Larry says, JJ, had you tried Jollibee? Yeah, Larry. Um, I'm going to... I have two videos. I have the grand opening here in Mira Mesa. And then I also did a mukbang video. Um a couple months old, probably January-ish. So if you just put Jaycation Jollibee, you'll see two videos come out. Um, but yeah, yeah, I've, I've, I've done Jollibee. And uh, let's see if I can entice uh, uh, Miss Norma next time I see her to do Jollibee with me in uh, Vegas. We'll see if we can entice her. We'll see what she thinks. Jose Salorzano says, try Pena Cafe Donuts while you're out here in Vegas. Just saying. Pena Cafe Donuts. Okay. All right. I'm going to have to uh, write that down right here. Pena Cafe. Crazy Cars 81. What's up? Hi. Will Stang. Are you planning to check out some May the 4th events at some breweries here in SD? Oh, yeah. There's a sour place down, down the hill here near my house. Um, they're really cool. We're really into that. May the 4th be with you. Ooh. I'll be back in San Diego May 4th. So, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, definitely. I love May the 4th be with you. <laughs> Frank says, hi, Jay. Have you considered assisting the restaurant chief, uh, chiefs with the foods you normally critique? I'm not a cook and I don't like critique badly. <laughs> like if, if, if I like something, I, you know, I just want to give people a good idea of like what's good and what's really, really good. <laughs> and, um, when it comes to like, if like if you want to see me talk about giving the place like something really negative um i'd rather just i don't want to be the person that like puts a place out of business so i if if i don't really like something i just probably it's better if it's if you don't have anything nice to say don't say it at all right so that's kind of the way i take with that and the things that i do like that's what i put on the channel and if there's something that i don't i just won't put it on there and if there's something i'm like neutral about i'll be honest about it I'm always honest about it. Like if it's good, I think it's good. It's, you'll, you'll know, you can see my reaction if if I really like something because I obviously go back. Um, Jay, is Circus Circus Buffet any good? You know, I haven't had Circus Circus Buffet since I was a kid and I don't know if it's open right now, but um, you know, maybe I might have to go see. I might have to go see. So I don't know why I'm not seeing these super chats, but now I see a super chat here. Thank you, Keanu says. Yo, Jay, how's it going? Keep up the great con content, dude. I love the Bill and Ted. Look at that. <laughs> Keanu says, man, thanks for the $2 fill up. Much love. Um, all right. So I lost my uh I lost my spot here. All right, there we go. <laughs> What's up, Cubs fan? Alan Tom. 
Callie Love, Francis, how about just picking up food from any of the Filipino joys and planning a picnic with your guy at Mission Bay or La Jolla and go for a stroll in Seaport Village? Yeah, see, that's that's a good idea. Um, ooh, a good Filipino spot that's uh, that that could be romantic is uh, La Carenderia. It's in one of my in my North County Hidden Gems video. Um, it's a sit down restaurant. It's near Moonlight State Beach and a nice walk into uh, Encinitas in the Old Town area over there. So yeah, La Carenderia. Really nice people. They 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 followed me. Um, yeah, hopefully they open back up more buffets by the time I go there. Um, shout out to Norma's buffet video too. Like she's got like a hundred thirty plus thousand views on that already. So so yeah, let's give her a, a a hand clap and she's about to hit thirty k subs. So yeah, shout out to Norma. Oh, it's Alex. That's the uh, the Cubs fan. Go Cubs all day, Jay. <laughs> Kissy cat. Pompsy is cool. Yeah, I like Pomps. I like Chris. Rhea Richardson, PL. La Vecindad neighborhood taco. Bomb food. Nice, Rob. Cool. La Vecindad. Taco lover. Yeah, Vegas nightclubs for sure. Um... I have a buddy at Hakkasan, so uh, I'm trying to get something done at Hakkasan. The thing about these videos is I'm probably just going to have to film it with my phone and just do like a outside of the club type talking about what the, how, how these clubs are like. Um, but I, I may or may not do a video next trip about the clubs. We shall see. That was Danny Pham who runs the group. Nice. Cool. Shout out Danny Fam. Yeah, I saw three people there with Super 73s. Um, Kev versus the world. Love your vids, man. Keep it up. Thanks, Kev versus the world. I like your avatar. Hearts, Broken Hearts, Space, Galaxy. Felmar, Matiang, Jay, do you have any recommendations for Indian food in San Diego? Okay, um, so I'm not very versed in Indian food, but I am planning on doing a video. I've talked to a restaurant. I just haven't gotten it together. So uh, it's coming soon. It's coming soon. I'll let y'all read Joshua's uh, funny comments, man. <laughs> Joshua brings the humor. It's in focus. Just give it a beer. <laughs> give it a toast. Just go to Mira Mesa. A couple of Indian spots there. Yep. And I'm talking to one place. So one of these days. Um, I think it's called Chaminar. C-H-A-M-I-N-A-R. Go check it out. I haven't tried it yet, so we shall see if I'll end up featuring it. I want to try it first. Um, Faith Hope. I used to live in Mira Mesa in 1987. My neighbor was Filipino. I often videotaped him goofing off. Maybe you know him. <laughs> There's 8 million Filipinos here in Mira Mesa. <laughs> um, but, you know, you never know. A lot of Filipinos know each other. Um, I didn't move to Mira Mesa until 89. Joyce. Hi, Joyce. Good evening, Jay. Back again for a second night. Love all your videos. Keep it up. Love from, from Buffalo, New York. Well, thanks for staying up. It's almost 11 o'clock there. All right. So everybody's talking about being ready. Callie Love, congrats on being the winner. Adriana was close. A new era. Thanks for all the SD vids. Currently living in Mexico reminds me I, why I love that city. Nice. Shout out USC Trojans. Reggie Bush, what's up? Kissy cat lids. <laughs> I love lids. I, they got a lot of money for me. Um, yeah, I don't know anything about crypto. Hey, Jonah Lynn. Hello from Temecula. Shout out to Temecula. One of these days I'll do wine tasting in Temecula. And I actually was uh, contacted by a vineyard. So, uh, yeah. Um, it's just the rest of this month is going to be all San Diego and Vegas. And then when I do, um, uh, in May, I'm going to have a stacked month. It's crazy. Like, like I'm excited. I'm blessed that, you know, there's all these businesses that want to work with my channel and, uh, yeah, it's starting to fill up and wow. I just saw a big super chat here. I need to find it. Wow. Lori. Thank you, Lori. Thanks so much. $24.99, Philip. I really appreciate that. Thanks so much. Wow, th this uh this uh stream yard doesn't tell me when 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 my uh I get these super chats. Like, look, Callie Love sent me a super uh a super sticker, a five dollar Philip. Thank you, Callie Love. I appreciate it. 
and uh, much love to you coming your way. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you for the uh, $5 fill up. And Lori, thank you too. Um, yeah, wow. And then look, Brian says, sent me a $5 super sticker. Wow, this thing is really dropping the ball for me tonight, uh, StreamYard. Usually it shows it up here on the top right, but it's it's not. Um, all right, let me speed this up because I am not faith hope what's up san diego padres yes they play tomorrow um fidel g gonzalez hi jay this is your tito fidel mark's dad mira mesa west little days keep the good work hey tito fidel what's up uh, shout out to mark shout out to the uh, gonzalez family yeah i totally remember funny enough when i played with mark in t-ball we were the dodgers i believe so yes you will find kid pictures of Jay Cation wearing Dodgers gear at like four years old T-ball. And you'll also see a picture of me with Manny Pacquiao wearing a uh, Dodger hat because it's Laker color. <laughs> I might as well show it to you guys now. It's me, my little brother Jello, and Manny Pacquiao. And the back then, New Era didn't make any Laker hats with a yellow, with a gold bill and a purple thing. So I, you know, I rocked the Dodger hat because you know what? I thought it was cool, but no, it's not for the Dodgers. When people are asking me like, go Dodgers. I was like, nah, it's, it's for the Lakers, but that hat is signed by Jock Peterson now. And it is, uh, in my collectibles, but don't kill me Padre fans. <laughs> Circus Circus Buffet is closed permanently. I don't know. I, I hope not because, uh, you know, I heard it's a pretty cheap buffet. Across from Circus Circus, it's not a buffet, but I want to check it out. It's Pepper Mill. I heard that's cool. Um, ooh, I could hear the SeaWorld fireworks, and I'm 10 miles away. Wow, SeaWorld fireworks. We can hear it on a nice night here from Mira Mesa. Wow, we got 83 people. Thank you for that, and thanks for hitting that like button. Kevin says, going to visit April 23 to 25. Group of 23-year-olds staying downtown to turn up. What's the best beach uh, for you 23-year-olds? Pacific Beach, no doubt. PB. Go to PB. Nowhere else. Thinking of Pacific or PB. That's it. PB, man. Nope, not Mission. PB. <laughs> Watching your videos this whole week. PB. PB, Kevin. Hello from Oceanside, making a low-carb pizza. Oh, better you than me. Wow, low-carb pizza. Nice. Shout out, Rubies. Yo, Jay, love the music that you are you lace your videos with. I've got original beats in that same vein. Let me know if you'd be interested in some beats. Oh, really, man? You make you made beats? Let's talk. Yeah. Shoot me an email, jcationmanagement at gmail.com. Um, yeah, shoot me an email. You know, that reminds me. Um, let me show you guys um let's see so guess what guys check this out this is cool oh man Here we go. Making this stuff up as I go along. All right. So check this out. Um, I, I met with Rob today, Rob Rast from Miles Board. Um, he, he, he makes my Miles Board. Um, well, he hooked me up with my Miles Board that I use around San Diego. And he gave me this Miles Board jet pack, right? Um, I, I, it, this is mine. This is my baby. <laughs> um, it's like a $200 backpack that holds the board. It's got a bottle opener. It's got a GoPro holder. It's got all these secret compartments. And then it, you can also, it also got one of those, uh, this thing, like you can attach this thing to the backpack. And when you're on your skateboard, you can pull somebody else on the skateboard with their battery that died. You can pull them on this. It's pretty cool. And uh, it's got like laptop holders and everything. Um, check this out, guys. This is the first everyone's going to hear of it. Um, if somebody buys a Miles board, uh, whether it's a Phantom or the upcoming Sex Panther or any type of board from from them, from Miles board, um, check this out. 
Rob made this for, for me uh, for just for just the Jcation viewers that are interested in buying this board. Miles board will give you a free jetpack, one of these jetpacks with uh, with promo code Jcation when you purchase an electric board. So it's a two hundred dollar bag, and um, right they even have sales on the boards. You can get a board for like like nine hundred bucks. I mean, it's still a lot, but it's usually like eight eighteen hundred bucks. So uh, so yeah, I'm excited so many cool things inside this backpack and i'm gonna start rocking this uh my psg backpacks uh going away um well it's not going away i'm gonna use it still every now and then but uh my miles jetpack is uh yeah shout out to rob rast Sh shout out to miles board um you'll see me shredding more and more with them and collabing more with them in the future um okay let's see oh, man i'm so behind um, Kevin says, cheers. I went there. It was boarded up and covered foam wall. Went there last month. Wow. Okay. That's Circus Circus. Hola, Vince. Uh, Madi's out there commenting. Drink some more so I can talk more. I don't need a drink to talk more. Believe me. Um, Adriana says, hi from SF. Oh, no. That's Kells. Never been to Palm Springs during heat. Probably can't even imagine. Dude, I played a baseball tournament there when I was a teenager in the heat. No bueno. <laughs> so do you know if you're, if they're making you wear a mask, if you go to San Diego Zoo, honestly, um, yeah, I mean, all these places are going to make you if you're not actively eating or drinking. Um, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure that they're still gonna, gonna have you wear a mask, but I mean, I'll, I'll look it up. I'll look it up. <laughs> Um, Mark says, I saw the Mexican ex Filipino spot you showed on your video. That stuff looks bomb. I want to try it now. Was the one, the one in Vegas that, that I'm going to be releasing with Norma. There's a, which Mexican Filipino spot. I can't even think. Oh, Sayolitas. I did a place that had, uh, did birria, seasick birria tacos in Vegas with Norma. So stay tuned for that. Cool. So we got 69 people I see on here. Hit that like button. Um, who got the best margaritas in town? Whew, I'm not a big margarita person. I hate to say it. Um, old town, I heard has good margaritas, but you know, those are tourist prices. Um, I heard Puesto's got good, good margaritas, but I don't know. Don't hold me to it. I'm more of a beer guy. Um, but yeah, try Puesto, try Cafe Coyote. Um, I can't think, uh, of other places um casa guadalajara that oh casa guadalajara i heard has good good margaritas um yeah jay that's not nice um bro what's up justin snoice yeah snoice is a good spot they make uh, good ube food um jj have you been to jollibee yeah man oh i already answered that right Snoice, um, favorite sports bars in SD. I would say Bubs all the way. Bubs is a favorite. Uh, Tivoli, Tivoli, Tivoli in the the gas lamp area. That's a really good spot. Um, man, let me see if I could think of other locals. The bullpen in Kearney Via, Kearney Mesa. Jay, I don't have internet. Could you check for me, please? Yeah, let me take a look here for you. Um, what did they say about the zoo here? I think the zoo, I mean, I think the zoo just does all the regular mask. Let me see. Yeah, I can't. I'm going to have to do a little more digging here. But the zoo does say. Yeah, they, they just say, you know, following the local state and federal agencies. So, you know, they're still going to be pretty, uh, pretty strict about it. You know, unless you're actively eating um, or drinking, they're going to tell you. To have it on. I mean, it could change as the tiers change, but I think that's pretty much standard here in San Diego. Um, yes, 
Nathan, yes. Um, um, I'm talking to a couple of people about making this uh, TJ. A couple, maybe one or two TJ trips because, uh, yeah, that's a yes for sure. We got something uh, TJ taco wise and TJ beer wise coming. Um, Mark, no, I, I've never even heard Ray and Nick, Nikki, Nikki. Um, Justin, I went to Sunset Cliffs today, man. It was great. Had some really high walls. Yeah. And if you get caught up there after high tide, <laughs> so such a, if you don't know how to get up those cliffs, it can be tough. Um, hi Jay. What's your favorite foreign beer? Astrea Galicia. See how quick I was with that? Entice Norma also for Jollibee. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure she'd be down for some Jolly Bee. Um, use your phone. Your phone. All right, Jay. No. Uh, let's not. Uh, let's not. Uh, you know. Be mad. Be that way with people. Let's be nicer to people and just try to help and stay positive. How about that? Um, two breweries. We have. In Palm Springs is Coachella Valley Brewery and La Quinta Brewery. They have they have some good stuff. Nice. Glad you guys can help each other out. That's all I ask for. Just be be cool with peeps. Thanks for that, Jay. Um, somebody from Morse chimed in last month. Morse was a ghost story on my private school's team facing Morse. Nice. Glad you can get that information. Thanks, J. Ray. Appreciate that, man. Um, have you thought of doing Highway 1 road trip series? You know, one of these days, I want to check out like the Paradise Beach over up north and check out all the cool stuff up there, like Big Sur. I've never really done that. So, yeah, maybe one of these days. Um. For now, Southern California is is the main focus. Sorry, I lost my connection. I recommended Snoice. Yeah, Snoice is great. Shout out to Snoice. I've done a video there. My uh, my top five Ube spots in San Diego. Um, I'll check out Carinder La Carinderia. Yeah, check it out. We'll be doing some brewery hopping. Nice. Um, can you believe calcified bill and Ted's bill and Ted's sequel? I haven't seen it. I haven't seen that. Um, have you been to M Mujeres brewery and Barrio Logan? I have not, not yet. Um, Barrio Logan, like I'll get there. I'll get the Barrio open uh, Logan. Yes. I sleep on the Indian places too. Yeah. But there are some good Indian spots here in San Diego. That's for sure. All right, no fighting on the chat here. That's why I need more moderators because, you know, we need to keep positive. We need to keep positive on here. Um, hello, Jason from Basilan, Philippines. What's up, Jason? How you doing? How's everything? Where is this at? All right. Hi, I am the, the kid that you saw at in and out Nice, dude. What's up? How you doing? Cool. You were, rock were you rocking that England shirt? Cool. That was nice. Uh, nice to say hi to you. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Shout out to in and out RT Girl Maryland, 11 p.m. isn't late for East Coasters. Oh, well, for some. <laughs> Bull Weevil. Thanks, man. Thanks. Awesome. Uh, I'll be looking forward to those winery vids then. Nice. Um, yeah, Larry, I used to, well, I wouldn't say used to be, I just haven't watched in a few years, but yeah, I was big on the rock. Um, yeah, the rock is my, my dude rock triple H rock and triple H were my, that was my jam. Um, what up Terry from San Diego? What's good, Terry? How you doing? 
Uh, my, uh, I've been in the sun. I've been in the sun all day. So, yeah, and this is almost gone. But nah, this ain't going to get me drunk. I'm just going to make me go to sleep. RC Girl Marilyn. Mariposa ice cream on Adams is real. Homemade ice cream. One top 10 for vacationers in U.S. magazine. Nice. Peppermill is a cool spot. Yeah, I want to check it out. I, I I saw a couple of videos at Peppermill. Looks pretty cool. I think Turn It Up World. Uh, DJ says, what's up, my guy? I believe there's Chicano Park Festival in Logan Heights 424. Food, beer, music, custom cars. Might want to check it out. Yeah, for sure. Especially if there's a lot of people. Last time I was in Chicano Park, uh, you know, it wasn't the best time <laughs> to go. Nice. Yeah, that's the video coming out tomorrow, which I still got to edit. So I'm going to edit that tonight. 89, dude. Wish it was 89 again. Got to have my phone, though. <laughs> Tribal Seeds in Escondido, Sleepwalker? Hmm, I don't know what that is, but cool. What's up from Encinitas? What's up, Gustavo Hernandez? Face says, I go to Mission Beach, Pacific Beach, Mission Beach. Dude, those are good spots. And I was just in PB today on Grand. Um, shout out to uh, Coffee Cycle. Those Pacquiao 24-7s rocked. I love those ones. I haven't watched 24-7 since then. Um, hi, Jay. Are you prepared to be... <laughs> I think Fernando Tatis, uh, Scott Kaplan, and um, Jessica Sanchez, and... Um, yeah, I think those people have definitely have tone, you know, Trevor Hoffman. Those are all the most famous people in San Diego. I'm just a YouTuber. <laughs> I'm a YouTuber. I'll always just be me, guys. Um, hey, Jay, have you ever tried a one wheel? I have in Barcelona. Um, it didn't go well. I tried it um, over in the El Born area in Barcelona. Um, I actually have it in one of my Barcelona vlogs. It, <laughs> I couldn't get on it for the life of me. Um, JJ, do you know, is Gabriel Iglesias, I've heard of Gabriel Iglesias, but I don't know much about him. You're never too old to go anywhere. Shoot. <laughs> you go, you can go to uh, Disneyland. You're never too old to go to Disneyland. Mission Beach, you can go to Mission Beach too. Ruby's Adventures, King and Queen has the best margaritas. Okay, cool. Thanks for that uh, suggestion. Casa di Bandini has some good margaritas. Nice. See, all the margarita lovers are putting them out now. There is a spot in Kensington. Nice. Yeah, Kensington's a cool spot. That's a nice chill area. Brian, what's up? What up, bro? Um, The gorillas did. I know that. Um, Yes, just check zoo requires mask. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, Old Town, I always think of margaritas for Old Town. Weren't we discussing orange tear? It's like discuss when you're lap dancing. <laughs> That's Josh for you guys, ladies and gentlemen, Josh. Um, Yeah, so orange tear, basically more people allowed inside. <laughs> That's what I get from it. Jaycation, oh, geez. <laughs> I'm a local, love your channel, great job, nice. Cool, dude. Uh, Ariel says, thanks for all your videos from NY mo moving to SD in August. We've been watching your videos. Get us ready for the move. Cool. We'll have a safe move from NY. And I hope you enjoy um, I hope you enjoy everything. Um, it's going to be hot. It's going to be hot in August. I'll tell you that. <laughs> I'm used to it. So, guys, like, I'm, I'm noticing, like, you know, I like to keep things positive and I'm always going to be that way. It doesn't matter if I have one subscriber or if I have a hundred million subscribers, but if, if I see something that, you know, um, like comments that I feel like are potentially inappropriate, I, I probably won't read them and I'll skip through them. So if you think you want to call me out and say, Oh, you didn't read it. Well, there's a reason why I didn't read it <laughs> because you know, I got, I got to be, I, I'm keeping things positive and I'm try trying to keep things the right way. So, Hope y'all understand. And if you don't, then sorry. You're just going to have to deal with it. <laughs> of course, I have internet. How do you think I'm on YouTube? See? Um, Chuck, food reviews and more. Hey, everyone. What's up, Chuck, food reviews and more? 
I'm heading out tonight to San Diego. Love your videos. Cool, Ramon. Have a good time. Appreciate it. Enjoy. It's hot over here right now. Um, Ultimate SD Sports Bar was La Jolla hot dog joint in the 80s called Sluggos. Nice. Kaminsky's in Poway is a good spot. Um, Creature Teacher. Oh, no way. Awesome. Glad to hear. Um, okay, where am I now? Um, I need to catch up because... Oh, here we go. You the man. Take a shot of wine for me. This is almost like drinking wine, dude. <laughs> Top three Filipino places to eat. My mom's food, my auntie's food, my Lola's food. Nah. Um, top three Filipino places to eat. Jame is cool. Um, Manila Sunset's cool. Tita's is cool. I'll give you another one. Zarlitos, that's cool. So yeah. The new Manila next to Rite Aid here in Mir Mesa, that's good. But Tita's is an OG spot. Yo, yo, Brian Brain. All right. I'm glad everyone's acting nice to each other here. Um, sup, Mr. J. What's up, Big Job33? How you doing? Um, DJ says, unless they push the days back, otherwise I heard all CA festivals will be back effect by July 1st. Yeah, and I also heard rumors that... Um, Del Mar Fair will be back at some capacity. So, yeah, cool. And I, I hope uh, Wonderfront's back. Let me know if you ever want to collab Barrio Logan for any other Chicano spots. Yeah, one of these days I want to do Barrio Logan, but, you know, we'll see. We'll see what's up there. But I, I do. I'm, I am interested in Barrio Logan. Favorite breweries in SD, Ariel. Um, I always say Ballast Point. Um, Ale Smith is always good for a stout. Uh, Mike Hess, uh, Harland, <sighs> South Norte is good. Um, I'm actually talking to this brewery called Virgin Beer. I haven't tried their beer yet, but, you know, I have a feeling I'll like it. <laughs> um, Stone, of course. What else? There's so many here in San Diego. It's crazy. Adriana says maybe... An, um, I'm thinking about doing something rest. Well, I'm doing cheap eats next week. So, I mean, that's kind of a restaurant week vid, <laughs> but yeah, yeah. That's next week. I think coming up. Hey, what's up, Brian? Jay, a suggestion. You should have a PO box for people to send you stuff. Yeah. I was thinking about that. You know, I don't know how many people would send me stuff, but I think I'm getting there. I think people would send me stuff. I don't know. <laughs> I've never really thought about that, you know, but like I'm reaching that area of my YouTube career where I might have to do a PO box for sure. Thanks, Callie Love. That was a great suggestion. Uh, Joey Bravado says, appreciate your videos, bro. I love San Diego and always go down there and it can be overwhelming on choosing where to go. Yeah, people always say San Diego is small, but I mean, as you guys can see for the last year in my channel, no, it's not small. San Diego County is huge. Kushfiend619 says, Have you tried Samita from Lucy's Donuts in Logan Heights? No, not yet. But Samita, Samita from Lucy's Donuts. No, but I'll have to try it out. What are you sipping on, Jay? Bruminator26 says, uh, This is a Moster Coffee and Coconut Speedway Stout. It's good. It's good. Almost done with it. Um, all right. Let me see if I can catch up here. Yeah. Mariposa ice cream. Cool spot. Nice. Sleepwalker. Are you ready to do a speakeasy video? If not, maybe sometime soon. So I have a friend that's doing a speakeasy video in Vegas. I don't want to talk about that because, uh, she hasn't, I don't know. I'll let her talk about it, <laughs> but, uh, I, I, I will, I'll do one in San Diego once they start opening up for sure. I've been trying to go to this, uh, um, false idol place, a tiki bar, which is kind of like a speakeasy kind of, um, but it's, it hasn't been open. Is your Padres cap, is your cap of Padres mashup looks cool. It's a uh, original good stock hat. So if you check out original good stock, they sell, um, these hats. Um, that's why the OG here on the side. Yeah. Thanks man. Um, what's up from Carlsbad dragon blood HD. What's up Carlsbad shout out. I was just there yesterday. Tribal Seeds is a band. Reggae. Nice. Shout out to Reggae. 
Larry, I think Shake Shack is undeniably good, but Cali joints even of the lowest tier bury it. Joshua knows what's up with, when it comes to hamburgers. Shout out to Rockies. Mario Lopez from Chula Vista. Yeah, but he's a LA Charger fan. <laughs> I do like Slater though. Um Joey Pepperoni, what's your favorite sushi place in San Diego County? Um, like right as I was answer, uh reading this, Toto Sushi came to my brain. So Toto Sushi, Carol Cannon Road. That's my favorite sushi spot. Um, he's a comedian. Okay, grab oh yeah, he's that big um Hispanic dude, right? Um Gabriel Iglesias. Hey, what's up, bro? Living like Larry, what's up? J Ray, thumbs up, man. Thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah, spread the love, man, for sure. Spread the love. Peppermill classic, but excellent breakfast and diner joints out west. Too many to count. Yeah, and I'm doing one diner joint next week for my cheapies video. So stay tuned to see what that is. Old Town. Cool, creature teacher. Thanks. Thanks for joining. Um, you going to do OC or LA videos? Yes. Yes. Uh, I want to do Filipino town. I want to do, uh, a video in garden Grove about the Asian food. I want to do a uh, downtown Santa Ana video, which I was talking about my, to my cousins that live in Santa Ana. So, uh, yes, the answer is definitely yes. And I want to do a beach series about OC beaches. Um, maybe this summer I'm doing great. Cool. Chuck. Thanks for, for joining. Oh, beer burps. Luis SD. What's up, Jay? San Diego, best weather. Let's go Padres. Yeah, we play uh, the Rangers tomorrow where Slam Diego began. Tita's Kitchen, OG spot, Joey. Have you done an American barbecue vid in SD? That's in the works. I've, I, I, I've listed my, my barbecue choices in San Diego. Um, probably won't get to it till like 4th of July, to tell you the truth. I'll be honest, Like I, I'll, but I will get to it this summer. Tita's, what is, is that in National City? Yeah, it's National City, Paradise Hills, I believe. J-Ray, top places for me for Filipino food is Jame Bake Shop. Yep, that's my spot. Fresh Pandesal for sure. Tristan Arnold Dingson says, sub J, Tristan Miramesa, awesome vids, bro. The fam watches you all the time. What's your number one favorite place to eat in Miramesa? Number one favorite place to eat in Miramesa. El Cotijan. <laughs> Cotijan. Um, yeah. <laughs> Cotijan, Vallarta's, Best Pizza, Focal Cali. It all depends. Um, so many. And then I just discovered that new Hawaiian poke spot um, in the business parks near uh, Green Flash or across from Green Flash. Um, Iglesias has a VW van collection. I'd say, what a waste of money. <laughs> uh, VWs are cool. Is that true? SD has the most breweries uh, in 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 America, probably. I think so. Yeah, for sure. Um, a lot of craft breweries here. Over two hundred, maybe even three hundred by now. Brian says, says Jay Kelly and I went to Pinoy Mexican place in MM. Didn't realize they had two sizes, largest giant dude. Salitas is oh is crazy huge huge burritos jay is the nicest guy on youtube well <laughs> my parents wouldn't say that i'm the nicest guy <laughs> i'm uh I, I try to stay positive for sure and uh but you know sometimes sometimes there's things that people will say and i usually choose not to um talk like clap back at negativity but sometimes if i i want to get a little snarky i'm kind of uh i'm, I'm a little snarky sometimes when i reply <laughs> have you tried pizza pronto in la jolla no no not yet pizza pronto no i haven't but sounds good sounds good gina what's up gina hey what's up what's your favorite lumpia spot in san diego any family member that makes lumpia <laughs> um gina there's oh man my cousin just told me about this lumpia spot that opened around north park i forgot the name of it but usually i i, I don't really try lumpia like any in restaurants and stuff i always just have them at parties but i mean if you get lumpia here in like nanai's barbecue near mesa those are always on point brian says dipping on some 
<laughs> this is almost like scissor 12 percent, but i need to have dinner soon i only had a i didn't even have a double double today at in and out i just had a single and i had fries and that's about it that's all i've eaten today so it's probably why favorite team san diego padres much more, yeah for for sure favorite team san diego padres okay where am i this thing just okay we're almost there milanesa samita at lucy's logan heights the sandwich used to be five bucks before the lockdown prices went up but still worth it oh that's a nice uh cheap eats tip right there milanesa samita at lucy's um favorite team baseball padres padres baby um the treehouse great friends great friends what's up haven't haven't uh, tuned in to scott and, uh, and uh, kaplan and crew in a while but shout out to kaplan and and alex and brown man happy mail yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna have to do a p.o box one of these days you moving away from sd no nah. no nah. um I'll be in Barcelona for a few months when everything gets better. Sup, fam? Checking in. What's up? David Garmo, shout out to you. Uh, gotta run. Gotta do homework. Nice channel. Keep up the great work. New fan. Thanks, Creature Teacher. Appreciate it. And uh, yeah, ha hope you have a good homework sesh. Um, get some Portos for me. <laughs> Portos, yeah. They have some near Knott's Berry Farm up in LA. I love Portos. I love those potato balls. I'm in San Diego with my Miles Phantom Pro. What's up? Hey man, if you get if you get the new uh get the new board that's coming out, use Jcation as your promo code, you'll get a free backpack, jetpack, jetpack. Rob said don't call it a backpack, call it a jetpack. It's a jetpack. Look at this thing. It's even got straps at the bottom. It's got straps up here, the bottle open. <laughs> awesome. Bro, I went to San Diego for college, and it was the best years of my life. Amazing weather, chill ocean vibes, and bomb Mexican feud. Yep, for sure, 24-7. Gabriel Iglesias, a.k.a. as Fluffy. <laughs> Any good pancero? Lumpia in Chula Vista? Ah, Tita's, um, Zarlitos, uh, Via Manila. There's also another place there next to uh, um, Addy Irwin Bautista's income tax area. Um, that that makes good seasig and ponce and lumpia too i just forgot the name of it um oh of course man check out my video just put jaycation la jolla i have a bunch of la jolla videos i just did a live stream there a couple months ago thanks for sending me to mike hess in seaport village now when i go back my glass gets filled for only five bucks see you you if you buy a flight they give you a chip they give you a cup and if you bring that cup in next time they fill it up for only five bucks I'll drink to that. And we got one of my good friends, Mr. Justin. What's good, buddy? What's good, man? I miss you, bro. I've been hanging out with our mutual friend, Tim. My friend, Tim, he's a famous barista here in San Diego. And he will uh, be in my video this weekend. So stay tuned for best coffee spots in San Diego. Adriana, by the way, my fiance and I tried POEs in Coronado last time we were in SD. Found it out by watching your vids. Keep it up, Jay. I'm glad you liked it. I mean, you know, it's it's, it's pricey, but that's the ambiance, you know. That's the date night spot. That's where you take. That's where I would take Vanessa Hudgens, you know, and uh, and propose. <laughs> uh, lol, El Coti. Um, do you have a Yelp I can follow? You have so many good recommendations. You know, I used to be Yelp elite back in like the early middle 2010s, but not, I don't use it anymore. I mean, I use it, but I don't review on it anymore, but I do have a Yelp. Yeah, for sure. Um, Jay, have you been to hash house of go, go? If you love breakfast, you need to hit them up, but they also have a spot. In yeah, I have. I've been to the one in Hillcrest. Um, the tractor room also has the same kitchen. Um, they have a South Bend hash that they, um, corned beef hash that they put out every now and then. Two thumbs up. A video on OC be beaches would be lit too, bro. Yeah, I I'm planning on this summer to doing OC beaches. Um, HFS poke is so good. I love poke. I'm going, I'm going to Hawaii soon for sure. Um, oh, wow. Dude, Jay Ray, man. 
you need to do best Korean barbecue spot in SD and I'll pay for it. Dude, thanks for the $50 Philip, man. And thanks for, you know, being being cool. You know, I know you and uh and Faith Hope, you know, are going back and forth, but I really appreciate you, you know, helping her out in the in the meantime and you know, thanks for keeping the positive vibes too. So, thanks for that. Appreciate it. You need to do the best Korean barbecue spot in SD and I'll pay for it. Um, yeah. <laughs> I need to educate myself more. I, I've only gone to Gen Barbecue, Mana Barbecue, and uh, where else have I gone? Taeguki. So those are spots that I know, but I need to try a few more places. There was a Korean barbecue place in Mission Valley that hit me up. So I may I may do that eventually. Um, let me catch up. I'm almost caught up, guys. Um, I've, okay, so I got that. Can't miss the bedroom shows. Jay won't crash it, and you can try to crack him up while he's drinking. See, that's why I do it, man. I want to like I love engaging with with everybody here. I think that's you know that's how it should be. People shouldn't be like you know not engaging with people that spend time and watching your videos. I think that's important. So that's why I do these live streams once or twice a week. I think it's important to uh, to answer back. To the positive stuff, you you guys know that you guys know that uh, I'm always about the the positive stuff. Um, Joe Flo says, "Don't tell me how to order a beer, boy." <laughs> I've been drinking a long time. Oh man, that's funny. Who told who who told you to order a beer? <laughs> how to order a beer? Gemma, hi Jay, watching all the way from Bay Area. Been a fan of all your videos. Keep it up. Thanks, Gemma. Appreciate it. Shout out to Beer Area, Bay. Bay I said Beer Area. See, I'm thinking of beers. Cause I'm drinking a beer. Um, shout out Bay Area. I want to try go back and do a senior C Sigs video. Bahai Kubo in Filipino Town. Ooh, LA. That's a LA thing, Rahar. Nice. Or Rajar Rahar. I haven't been in SD six years ago. There's lots of boba places. Oh, tons of boba places. Crazy. I can't even keep up. You should check out Morning Glory, Polite Provisions, and Raised by Wolves. Oh, Raised by Wolves. I went there with my homie Patrick a couple years ago. Cool spot. And yeah, once it's, I think it might be open by now. I think I saw some action there. Where is the signed Tony Gwynn ball? I ha I do have a Tony Gwynn ball signed. It's not here though. It should be. It's kind of embarrassing. I got Pujols. I got Pudge Rodriguez. <laughs> I got S y y Young Hervis Solarte. <laughs> um, my Tony Gwynn ball somewhere. Um, I went to In and Out. Yeah, man. You saw me. Um, what's your favorite place for beer you talk as well? I heard Fernandez, Ed Fernandez is a good spot and I'll be going there really soon. As soon as like next week. Um, I am. Yeah, dude. Um, were you wearing, you were wearing the England Jersey, right? Oh, nice. Part Filipino shout out. Um, shout out to my beautiful girlfriend, Annalisa here watching with me. Nice. Kush fiend six one nine. 619, shout out. We were 619, then we converted to 858, but I got love for 619, 858, 760. Uh, Rahar says, West Covina, Wesco. Shout out Wesco off the 60. Uncle Art, Auntie Minnie, love y'alls. Um, my cousin Army, no, I love Wesco. I love Wesco. All love for Wesco. I grew up going to Wesco. SD is huge. It is overwhelming, yes. That's why I get mad when people say, San Diego, there's not much to do there. Really? Not much to do? Let me show you. Thanks for the support. Cool. I'm glad you guys are getting along. Damn, dude, your stream is popping. <laughs> Proud of you, bro. <laughs> Thanks, man. If you guys haven't seen my buddy Justin, he's 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 not big on social media, but uh, go check out my New Orleans food video. Justin's in it with me. JK, I'll probably be the worst person to comment in your YouTube, but I like to talk. <laughs> yeah, man. As long as, dude, as long as you just don't, you know, go over the line and, you know, attack people. I, I, that's the thing. I don't like people going after other people. It's, I like to keep a positive vibe here on the channel. But yeah, man, you know, common away. Uh, Lou Aquino, have you tried Sayulitas? Yeah. Um, I did a mirror, my, my Mira Mesa video. Try it out. Check it out. Mira Mesa. Just put Mira Mesa Jaycation. Um, yes, it was, uh, in my, um, top, must try five must try pizzas, David, check it out. Um, new date, September 1921 earth fair Balboa park. 
Nice. Earth. Oh yeah. Babo Park's gonna start having all those uh all those things going on. Filipino style barbecue at Park's finest near Filipino town in LA. Ooh, that sounds good. Man, you got some LA spots. Do I have a TikTok? Yeah, Jaycation TV. Jaycation TV is my TikTok. But I don't really do TikTok as much. <laughs> um, Creature Teacher, thanks, man, for the 199 super sticker. I really appreciate it. Much love, Creature Teacher. Yo, he spends time for us. <laughs> You're not a peasant. Come on, man. <laughs> thanks, though. Thanks for thanks for the love. You get, no one's a peasant. Y'all's are y'all's are important. All equally important. <laughs> hey, Elizaga. Um, I'm not too familiar with that because I don't do that stuff. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. I just don't do it and not a good YouTube subject. <laughs> um, Eric Brooking, hope to see you up here in the winery and yeah. Oh yeah, dude. That's definitely man. Definitely. Eric, uh, has a winery. Let's talk. Let's talk for sure. Um, Let's see. Yo, JJ, just finished a long day of freelancing. Saw that you were live. Yeah, what's up, Aaron? Go check out Aaron's podcast. Uh, it's like a it, like a Comic Con Hall H podcast. What's up, Aaron? Shout out, man. Shout out, dude. Yeah, feel free to link your podcast down below. Um, have you dined indoors yet since move SD went into the orange tier? Yes, and I, I well, I drank a coffee indoors today, so that that counts, right? Vince, what's up? Good vibes. Shout out to Vince. What's up, man? I talked to you on email today. What's up? Um, yeah, good vibes. That's all I'm about. Um, do it. Senior Seasick is great. Check out Marley's Treats too for all your Ube dessert needs. All right, Gemma. Cool. What part of uh, San Francisco do you live in? Um, yo, I finally went to Tiguan Museum at Alesmith. I got teary-eyed, dude. Don't don't get me started, man. When I found out Tony Gwynn passed away, I was boarding a plane. I remember I was in the Algarve in Portugal, um, flying to Lisbon, and I read it on Twitter. I, like Kevin Acey or somebody posted that he passed away, and people like when I boarded the plane probably were like, "Why is this guy just bawling his eyes out?" And it was because Tony passed away. You know, I was crying all the way to my seat. I was literally on the tarmac, and I read it, and just I yeah, one of the saddest moments ever to hear about. You know, next to Kobe. Tony Jr. RIP guys. I was the other kid with dark hair. Oh, nice. Cool. Um, nice collection. Thanks, David Garmo. Um, hope more restaurants open in June for my ex ex birthday. <laughs> Definitely Mission Beach with kiddos and for me, Stone and Coronado Brewery. Yeah, great spots. I've been drinking the uh Mexican lager um from from Stone lately. Um Char. I like your old school SD Chargers avatar in Coronado uh, Brewery. I like their pineapple farm. Go Pods. Jay, if you got a PO box, I'm going to send you a Garden of Life digest digestive enzymes. Taking them while drinking or eating will change your life. <laughs> All right. I'll look into the PO box, guys. Jay Ray. Uh, dude, Jay Ray, man. Another 50 spot, dude. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, man. Thanks, dude. Like I said, man, just keep do your best. Keep positive, man. Let's keep positive. Appreciate it, dude. Thanks for the 50 spot. Hi, J Ray. You are so kind. Great to support this chat. For sure. For sure. Thanks, Faith Hope. I see you guys getting along. <laughs> um, DJ Ramirez, Char Charles, for most restaurants are back and open again. You you're good. You'll have mad selection. Um, like to know a little about that camera behind you. Um, this is the Canon M50. I am about to throw it out the window. Um, this is a new mini tripod that I got, Kurt, um, by suggestion of my friend Norma Helly, and I actually really like it. I'm going to get a new camera probably in the next half year because this camera is only cool when it sits down and it doesn't move. Very fidgety. J Ray talking about that crypto. I don't know anything about that. My cousin Kells needs to tell me more about crypto because I don't know anything about it. Nice guy. Jay was hired by Disney. You have to be a whole other level of not. <laughs> Dude, 
<laughs> believe me, Josh, believe me. Me, my friend Brian, and my friend Jason, all apartment mates in Disney for the five months. We are the biggest blank holes that you'll ever meet, especially when we're together. <laughs> Um, but I do a good job hiding it. <laughs> Where can I buy the best Babinka in SD? Ooh, Jimay. Jimay for sure. Jimay. Um, G-I-M-M-A-E. Jay, have you been to Belching Beaver? I love peanut butter stout. I love their Mexican chocolate. Good stuff. Faith. See, this crypto stuff, it really confuses me because I know nothing about it. I know nothing like John Schnur. Char says, DJ, oh, okay, thanks. Oh, look, I'm caught up. There's still the 1%. She will do well once the rest of the 99%. <laughs> uh, Got to get a Sony camera. You know, I, I, I tried a RX100, but I don't know. I might try Sony again. Uh, my friend Norma, Norma Heli, shout out to Norma. Um, she's got a Sony. All right, I got, let me close my window real quick. I don't know if people can hear me outside. Um, best Babinka is at Manila Sunset Corner. Yeah, that's what. Yeah, listen to Mari. Best Babinka is at Mila, Manila Sunset. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna shut down this vlog real quick. Now, Jay Ray, I want to send you a postcard as a thank you. So I'm gonna send you this San Diego postcard, dude. So if you can email me at jcationmanagement at gmail.com or DM me. I'll send you that postcard, man. Once I send all these other postcards. So yeah, for sure. And uh, let's see. Let's see here. Okay. We got another giveaway. Let's do one more giveaway. I'm going to give away. Uh, well, now this is a classic. It's a flying Leathernecks um, Fly Marine license plate holder. I'll give this away to somebody um, that answers the question here correctly. Um, and okay, here we go. I'm going to put this question up and whoever gets it first will win. So here, here's the question, guys. I'm not even going to give you guys a countdown. What is the name of the coffee spot and brewery collabing on my shirt? What is the name of the co coffee spot and brewery collabing on my shirt? And I need to write that Kelly Love won this. Um, Kelly Love. What is the name of the coffee spot and brewery collabing on my shirt? If you guys can name that, you guys win this. This postcard. I'll personalize it and send it off to you. <laughs> Mostra and Harlan, you got one of the two, right? Oh, wait. Mostra? No, it's not Harlan, but you're close. Um, Ghost Bear, have a good night. Nice, Faith. Not quite. So some people are getting it half right. Some people are. Let's see here. Oh, all right, Vince. Have a great night, man. Thanks for coming in. And uh, yeah, let's talk, man. Let's Zoom soon. Um, I have no idea. I'm giving you guys the answers right there, right there. <laughs> Everyone's so, so close. Adriana's close. Um, you just got to get... Uh, you guys are so close. Look. Someone's going to get it. There we go. Aaron L. got it. Aaron, please um, 
direct message me on Jcation TV on Instagram or Jcation Management at gmail.com. Get me your address. And uh, yeah, congrats, man. You win the postcard here. <laughs> um, okay, let's see. Let's see. Oh, uh, John K. Check out Manhattan Hermosa Redondo when in LA. Thanks, John, for the uh, two ninety nine fill up. Much love, much appreciated. Thank you so much. And uh, I haven't seen you on the chat before, so thanks, John. Yeah, definitely. I, I, I grew up going over to uh, places like Hermosa and Manhattan, so that's that's great. Um, Larry says best beach in SD. I'd always ha I'd always have to say La Jolla Shores. Mission Beach, um, Del Mar area. That's cool. Um, Encinitas, I'm starting to like later in life. Um, been living in SD all my life. Just moved to Mira Mesa and found a lot of places thanks to you. Great channel. Thanks, Luis. Cali Love, take it easy, Jay and everyone. Have a great weekend, y'all. Nice, Cali Love. Yeah, send me your address if you haven't already. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Uh, Best Babinka. Yes, Manila Sunset. Yeah. Jay Ray, good stream. Till next time, Faith. Hope your daughter is doing the right thing. Thanks, guys. Thanks for getting along. <laughs> Larry, question? Most Okay, so everybody starts answering here. Have a good night. Have a good night, Faith. Um, and yeah, Aaron got it. Mostra and Ailsmith. Thanks, Artsy Girl Marilyn. Um... <laughs> Joshua, um, you got this. Aaron L. PB. The guy kissing the nurse was my dad's friend. Both are past. Now from J Rocks in Houston. Oh, interesting. Interesting thought there, Jesse. Um, or interesting fact. Have a great weekend. You too, Adriana, Adriana. Yo, peace out, y'all. Have a good night. Yeah, have a good night. Yep, I messaged you on IG. Thanks, Callie. Appreciate it. Um, what are your thoughts on El Patron Taco Shop? Um, I like their ceviche, really good. And I like that Canelo Alvarez likes it. And there's Canelo Alvarez uh, signatures all around the area there. Um, I haven't yet. And I like their tostado too. Their tostada is really good. We'll be moving from the Bay Area to SD soon. Nice. Shout out Bay Area, Mr. Laker. Nice. I like your uh, screen name. What's your favorite Filipino boxer? Um, well, yeah, Manny Pacquiao. Wait a minute. Did I say, see, dude, I'm tripping. So I said I was going to give this away. Well, I'm going to give this away to whoever uh, just won the last one. And if I, the postcard too. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm out. I got to eat dinner. I'm starving. So uh, in the words of Ron Burgundy, thanks to everybody for the circuit, <laughs> for the super chats. And in the words of Ron Burgundy, stay traveling, San Diego. Um, What it do, EJ? Shout out. I'll see you guys later. We're we're peacing out. Thanks for every uh, everyone coming in tonight. Later.